We live 45 minutes away from Reno, Nevada, and the road I take to get home from Reno is 580 South, which runs between Reno and Carson City, Nevada. On January 3rd, uh, the Highway Patrol, or NDOT, shut down 580 South, except for one lane um, because of the weather. And at the time, I heard that the guests were up to 80 miles per hour. But I sat on the road from 3.15 p.m. until I want to say 7.09 p.m. when I was finally allowed to cross in a single uh, file lane of cars. And the road is six miles and it took about 40 minutes to cross. And that was because uh, the wind gusts were so severe. And by the time I crossed, my car was covered in ice. And shortly after I crossed over, the road was shut down completely um, until the next morning. But this is just a video of portions of the Highway 580 that I tried to cross. And um, I haven't done anything with this video. The, the timing is exactly how it was. I drove at about probably 10 miles per hour. And the wind gusts I had read were up to 80 miles per hour. But this is Washoe Valley um, between Reno and Carson City. We had sat for so long on the highway that people were starting to run out of gas before they crossed over Washoe. And this car in front of me, she had actually flagged down a police officer right before we started crossing, before we knew we were going to cross over. And um, she told him she was running out of gas and other people had run out of gas and the police officer was saying he was trying to get tanker trucks down to be able to um, refuel the vehicles. But um, the whole road, uh, it doesn't look as bad as it was, but it was a sheet of ice. And I guess I heard, and I don't know this to be a fact, but that people were being blown off the road. And the car in front of me, I don't know what happened to her after she crossed over. Um, I hope she made it to a gas station. But it was the most bizarre thing I'd ever sat through waiting to cross over this highway and then crossing over was definitely experience. If I hadn't been able to see the headlights in front of me, um, it would have been a pure whiteout. So it was just interesting. The whole reason for the shutdown was to keep people from either lane running into each other if they were blown off the road. And so a pilot car would take one lane of pro of cars across in one direction and then turn around and bring another lane of cars across from the other um, side. But there were a few people as we were crossing that decided that they did not want to wait any longer and um, they would pass us <laughs> going fairly quickly. So this car and uh, two other trucks passed us while they were supposed to be in the single lane with us. But other than that, we got across safely and these people did as well and there was only the one semi truck that I saw that was off the road as I crossed over.